Hello YouTube, this is NJDelphan26, today with another tutorial for the Blackberry Storm. I actually haven't done a Blackberry Storm tutorial in conjunction with the MacBook since I stepped through Pocket Mac Sync Manager for you guys, which was a while ago. This video is very similar, it's about Blackberry Media Sync Manager, created by Blackberry Research in Motion. You can download it off the BlackBerry website, link in the description of the video right over there. So this application, unfortunately, is a separate application. It is not built into Pocket Mac Sync Manager, and you will have to run both these applications to do two different things. Remember in Pocket Mac, that backs up your contacts, calendar, and other personal information, but doesn't really do anything when it comes to media. And that's what the Media Sync Manager is all about. Now, the unfortunate thing is that they are two different programs, and you cannot run Pocket Mac Sync Manager until you've uninstalled the Media Sync Manager, which is a huge con and a huge inconvenience on BlackBerry's part, which is one reason why I believe the iPhone thrives a little bit more than the Storm, because it has iTunes, and everything is one click, bang, boom, you're done, all in iTunes. But anyways, let me just step this through for you guys. So first, I'm just going to plug in my BlackBerry and wait for the computer to recognize it. As you can see, BlackBerry Media Sync Manager did pop up almost instantaneously, and it did recognize my BlackBerry over here. It says BlackBerry 1, BlackBerry 2. That represents the SD card and the device memory itself. So BlackBerry Media Sync Manager does recognize your phone, and it is free, of course. And it does not sync videos, but it does sync all your songs with iTunes or for Windows, Windows Media Player. Again, this is cross-platform between Mac and Windows, except for Mac, it is in preview. I'm not sure why they call it that, but it works nonetheless. So, similar interface towards iTunes. It does show you the status bar in different colors, representing how much space you've used, playlists, and your free space. Now you guys can see that it does say I have 6 gigs free, 6.5 gigs free. That is because that the BlackBerry does come pre-installed with an 8 gig micro SD card, which you guys would know if you have a BlackBerry Storm, or I've seen my unboxing videos on that. So I'm going to sync my recently played songs, because I do not know anything about all my playlists. I, again, guys, I do not go through my playlists. I usually just check off which songs I want and just do manual sync when I sync with my iPod. So I will just check off recently played. So let me look for that. I have it checked off right there. And I'm going to click sync. And that went extremely quickly. Don't even think. Maybe it didn't copy. Check it out. Click on media. And says to access files on the media card from your device, disconnect your device from your computer. So I will do that. All right. Now it's going to scan, go into music, and it says that I have seven songs Bulls on Parade, Eruption by Van Halen, Freebird, Have a Nice Day, Paranoid Android, Into the Night, and Show Me What You Got. So apparently those are my recently played songs. All great songs. I do love every single one of those. And I'll just sample one of them just to show you guys what it, that it does work. Alright, so I'm not going to play the whole song because that does go against YouTube's copyright issues and terms and conditions, so I'm sorry for not playing the whole song for that, but you guys can see that it does work. I'll just play another song just to prove it to you. Eruption. Alright, so that did work. Now, unfortunately, BlackBerry Media Sync Manager for Mac is still in beta and will not sync your videos with your BlackBerry. So to do that, you just copy and paste your videos straight into the BlackBerry 2 port over there, so you copy it to your SD card via the USB, just regular copy and paste that you guys saw on the Mac itself. So I will show you, I do have a video. My house, it's not my house, it's actually a Scrubs episode, so you guys can see. Her last shift at Heart her new in 
practice. So you guys can see the video quality on this is great. This is in MP4 format. Does not lag at all. Great video player, great screen. Unfortunately, does not work with BlackBerry Media Sync Manager, but I'm sure once it is released out of beta, Research in Motion will definitely make it compatible for video and hopefully combine it with Pocket Mac so it's all in one application so it can at least be some sort of competition towards iTunes. So guys, just a tutorial on BlackBerry Media Sync Manager for the BlackBerry Storm and obviously the Mac. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.